Hey, love bugs, it's Riles. I'm back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed today. I'm doing blessed and highly favored, and I definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, welcome. Much love to you. And for my extended family, my returning subs, thank you so much for the love and support you send me each and every day. It is so greatly appreciated for the vibes, you know, the, good, the prayers, the blessings y'all just send me is like as much as I'm sending to you, you return it back just the same, and it's so beautiful. So thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. And for with that being said, much love to you. Namaste. Love and blessings, love and light, and many blessings are yet to come for you. And if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already, what are you waiting for? Like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And if you feel like you're comfortable enough, go ahead and drop me a line. I love the chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Or even if it's about the positive feedback of the video or you just telling me, you know, basically your, uh, your opinion about the video. As long as it's positive, just keep positive. That's what I always say. And, or even if it's just about your gift, it's just all welcomed. And if you feel like, you know, you really resonate with my video and it really gave you some good insight, go ahead, spread the word, like and share. It, it'll all be greatly appreciated. And thank you so much from the bottom of my heart for stopping by my channel today. And the music I'm listening to is called Feng Shui Health Spa Wellness Yoga Music Spirituality Spirituality and Anti-Stress. So, you know, some of us need this. You know, if you like going out into nature, you know, some, some of us like me, <laughs> I'm allergic to pretty much everything. So it's like, even though I love to do it, I know my, I'm, my nose will start itching real bad. Or I will start sneezing like crazy, or my eyes will start itching, or they'll, you know, start getting puffed up because of all the pollen. But, you know, that's why I love to listen to it, even if it's like bad days where I can't get outside. This is kind of like some good music that you would love to listen to when I'm not able to go out in nature. Because I know it's supposed to be raining like three, three or four days this week. But anyways, my video today is about Twin Flame 101, Hey Oka's Finding Their Highway to Heaven. And I'm not talking about like we're dying or anything like that, but we're finding our highway to heaven. And I know I must be on point. Thank you, Mimi. Because <laughs> you started saying, girl, you're psychic. That's your psychic vibe lets you know you're on point. You're like in the right direction. And um, I'm not talking about like you're dying. Like you're, I'm just talking about like a lot of us are like earth angels, uh, empaths that are, you know, we feel like. You know, we're being here before. We're coming down to help somebody. And it's just like me growing up. I'm like 41. So, um, if you're around my era, you know the, the show called my uh, with Michael Landon. I forgot the other guy's name that he played on Little House on Prairie with. But, uh, God, dog, I forgot his name. But y'all know who I'm talking about if you've seen this show from back in the day. Um, it was called Highway to Heaven. I used to watch that show with my mom religiously. Every time it came on, and I forgot, it was like, I think it came on every, every week. Um, every day, but then um, the new ones would come on once, you know, once a week, like the regular shows, or whatever. But then now it's starting to make sense with me because I'm, I see him, him, Robert. No, that wasn't Robert Guillaume. Um, probably Robert Guillaume is. I don't know why that name just popped up in my head like that. But it was like when I, I started seeing my life as that. And you probably see your life as that too, like Dad Ross, and I wouldn't even think about that. And it's so true. You're finding your highway to heaven. We came down. We're on contract. We're fated to do something. We At first, we don't know what it is. But with them, you know, there were angels that, you know, basically, I don't know if they got in trouble or whatever. <laughs> they got in trouble. And so they had to be, they felt at first it was kind of like punishment. I, I'm trying to remember the way the plot went. It's just like they came from heaven or something like that. And they basically came into people's lives to help them fix whatever issues they had just so they can finally go back to heaven. You know, I'm like, oh, I can finally go back to heaven. You know, we did all these duties or whatever. But that's what we're doing. We're finding our highway to heaven. You know, we're doing these things. We're helping people. We're pushing positive light to people's lives. We're pushing more positive lights to ourselves. We're growing. We're knowing more about ourselves. A lot of us are awakening. I mean, it's just joy when I hear people say, you know what, Roslyn, I just found out I was hey, okay. And I mean, it could be 
sometimes it can be devastating because you're like, what is this? You know, is something mentally wrong with me? Is this, you know, I haven't heard about this before. And it's like, um, wow. You know, it's a beautiful thing. I mean, even though, like I, like I said a lot of times, it's a lesson and a blessing, but it can be a curse at the same time because it's like if you don't know what you're dealing with, it could be very hurtful because you're trying to understand why am I like this? Why do I feel certain ways when I get around people? Why do I start stuttering on my words when I know I got full confidence? And it's not even a you it's just them you can't put the words out because it's not you're not supposed to talk to them it's just something that's just not right you know us in past we be around people that we something's off you'll get start you'll, you'll get you know turned on your words and it is just like when I was thinking more about that show it's just like wow you know look at all the things that you know there was abuse there was drug use, you know, there was different things. It was kids running away, you know, and all these things. And they helped fix their families. They helped fix their lives. And it's just like Ayanka fixed my life, like back in the 80s or early 90s. I can't remember when that was. But it was back late, back in the day. But it was a beautiful show. So it's just like a lot of things are starting to come to the forefront for me. It's just like, what am I doing? You know, sometimes it seems surreal, like this is what I'm doing for real. <laughs> I'm helping people. I was like, shoot, I couldn't find myself out of a hole in a wall. But yet, I, you know, and this was way back in the day now. But it's just like seeing myself now. I would have busted out laughing like 10, 15 years ago if you would have told me I was doing this. Like, yeah, right, whatever. And it's just like, but I've always wanted to play my part in the world. I'm bringing some, some kind of love, joy, and happiness to somebody's life. And you're doing the same thing. You find your highway to heaven. Be that best version of yourself. Love what you do, even though it does not have its greatest perks at times. But trust and know, these experiences are going to be well worth it. It's going to help you grow. It's going to give you so much power within yourself that you probably didn't even realize you have. That's your heaven. And, you know, if you're on your way to trying to reunite with your twin flame, if you have a twin flame, it's, it's going to guide you straight there. It's going to really guide you straight there. So find your highway to heaven. Find that inner truth. Find that inner strength because you have it. Because we have been through so much, so, so, so much. And you are truly loved. You are truly loved. And it gets me emotional because it's like it's a beautiful feeling. It's really a beautiful feeling because you really feel truly loved. And it's like, be that best version of yourself. You know, there's days when when it feels like it's confusing and you don't know where you're going. That's fine. That's okay. You don't have to beat yourself up for it. You, you know, it's like it's just a new day to start all over again. So find your highway to heaven. Be the best version you can possibly be. You know, even if you, you feel like I'm not worth it. I don't matter. Yes, you do. You're here for a purpose. You didn't you didn't come this far just for you to be confused or anything like that. You might not know where you're going, but no, it has brought you so far. It has brought you so far. Even though things might fall apart from you, be taken away from you, it's okay. When things fall apart, it means things are coming together. When you feel like you're about to lose your mind, that's when it's time for you to find it. And this is the time. No, no time like the present. So I hope you were able to get something out of this video. I love you guys so much. Love bugs. I, I haven't called you guys so much. I, I try not to use that word. But I love you, love bugs, so much. And I will talk to you later. Much love to you. Be be blessed. Be kind to one another. I'm sorry if I got a little bit sappy because I almost felt myself about to cry. But it was a beautiful moment. So Y'all forgive me. Y'all understand. Don't judge me. Don't judge me. <laughs> but I hope everybody stay blessed and prosperous on the rest of this week and forevermore. And much love to you. Like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell. Drop me a line or two. I would love to hear from you. Uh, just even if it's a send positive feedback, it is always greatly welcome. And I will talk to you on my next video. Much love, peace, and be wild. Well. Like and subscribe, drop me a line, and I will holler at you later. Peace. Bye.